Well, what I want to do today is I want to create a class. That's what we're going to do. And here we go. So I start off with the word class. Move this. Keyword class. I'm going to key in my class and a colon. And I'm going to give it a property. I'm going to say uh, a equals five four three two one. Then I'm also going to define a function. I'll call the function quite originally f open close parentheses and a colon. And I'll just say return onion. Which is Korean word for hello. I learned that a while ago. Alright. What I want to do now is I want to call this function that's in the class called my class. And this is how I'm going to do it. I'm going to key in my class dot f open close parens. If I just key in my class and a dot, watch what happens. Up it comes. There's A and there's F. Well, that's the guy I want. F. Open, close parens. Hit enter. And it says onion. Hey, that's pretty good. What if I key in print and then my class dot F. Open, close friends, and then close friends, matching friends. I get on Yen again. <laughs> That's pretty good. We created a class and a method within the class. That's what that function is. If it's within a class, we call it a method. And we were able to call that method. Well, uh, what if I wanted to key in a little bit more than that? What if I key in prints uh, hello in Korean is colon and then space quotes comma my class dot f open close prints and close prints for the print statement. Wonder what I'll get. Oh, hello. In Korean, here's Anya. Well, that looks pretty cool. But it's so much typing. My class dot f. What if there were an easier way to do that? What if I could take that class, my class, and assign it to a single letter variable like x? And I say x equals. Uh, my class. I wonder if I could do that. I'll bet I can. Oh, I didn't get an error. So I guess I could do that. Let's try x dot. And then let's see if I get it. Oh, I do. A and an F. It looks to me like what I just did was I instantiated a, an, I made an instance of my class called x. X is an instantiation of my class. Huh. An instance of my class. So we call it an instantiation. So x dot uh, x dot f open close parens and I'll bet it'll say hello world. It did, but in Korean on yeah. <laughs> well, hello. Now what if I want to say and then print hello comma in Korean is single quote comma now my class dot f no now I can just say x dot f open close parens and close parens to for the print statement print uh, function here we go wow it worked. Hello in Korean is on him. So what we're doing here is we're 
accessing the the methods yes we're accessing the defined methods of the function my class and it's being returned to us it's amazing and we we instantiated my class into a variable called x and now I can even key in x dot what was the name of that variable a and I'll get five four three two one one that is just amazing all right well I think that's about all I have to say on classes for the moment that was a good introduction I hope this is George Bull saying bye-bye now.